The Chicago Bears have signed offensive lineman Dakota Dozier off of, you know, the Minnesota Vikings. Now, people are not very happy about this signing. And I, all I have to say about it is chill out, Bears fans. You have to chill out. This is a depth signing. And I know that's pretty much what Ryan Poles has been doing. That's really all Ryan Poles has been doing is depth signing. <clears throat> But you have to remember, you don't have much of an offensive line. And, plus, I don't think he's going to be a starter, obviously. I, at least I hope not. Um, he's probably going to be a depth signing. And I'm guessing he signed a very, 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 very cheap deal. Um, because a lot of people are saying he's not very good. I didn't pay attention to him because I'm not a Minnesota Vikings fan. But... Um, I said this on Twitter, and people were not very happy with me. I say that in all of the Bears tweets just because, you know, I'm optimistic. I think it's funny. I, I actually like the signing because it's depth. Everyone's saying he's absolutely terrible. But, I mean, <sighs> gotta give this guy a chance, I guess. At least in, in uh, preseason. Or to even make the the squad. Like, you never know. He's probably not even going to make... He's just signing him just in case, okay? He's signing him just in case. We got nobody else. Um, I don't know if this means Ryan Bates is not going to be signed. I hope that's not what it means. But people need to chill the hell out. It is just a quick depth signing. I don't think Ryan pulls... At least I hope not. I don't think Ryan Poles um, expects too much from him. Um, yeah, I, I, that's at least what I believe. Um, I did not... People were not too happy with me tweeting this. And uh, I just thought it was really, really funny. Because Bears fans, Vikings fans, even some Steelers fans were kind of like, what the fuck are you talking about? I'm not saying he's, this is the best signing ever. I'm not saying that, but it's a depth signing. People need to chill the F out. It is nothing except a depth signing. And Ryan Poles, who I expect to evaluate offensive linemen pretty decently, um, looks at him and he's like, okay, he's not like the next freaking... Taron Armstead, but he's just somebody who's there who can compete for a starting job or at least our roster spot. That is most likely what this is. People need to chill the hell out. I'm not saying we're gonna. He's uh, okay. I understand why people are mad. You cannot have Justin Fields have another bad year. You cannot. And the way he's gonna have another bad year is by him being on his ass, okay? He cannot be on his ass all year like he was last year. I blame that mostly on the GM and coach, obviously. There were some times where Justin Fields didn't play very, very good. Um, but I think it was the scheme. It was the surrounding... It was everyone surrounding him. It was the coaching staff. It was everything. Justin Fields was put in a terrible spot last year. So you need, I understand where people are coming from. You need an offensive lineman that will keep him upright. And this guy is definitely not it. <laughs> At least people are saying that. So let me know what you think in the comment section below. Everybody needs to chill the F out. And uh, I will see you guys in the next one. Have a good day.